absence of an opening. When did you last see the Elderman? Leave us be. It is not your place to be asking such questions. Bitch. Can your guard speak through you, Hedavrid? Can he tell me where the Elderman is? Our lord is not a trained dog who speaks on command. My goodness. Something on your mind? Eivor, I realize the strides you've taken to aid me. My oath to you will last an eternity. You'll owe me a blood oath when all our work is done. Blood? Dear lord. Wait here till I return. Hospice, I believe. Yeah. Oh, so brown area, those are like here. Better hope to take your room around in the morning. That's what playing with shit. Hunwald's father was recuperating here not long ago. Someone may have seen him depart. Bob entrance. Do you know where your elderman is? I can tell you a few things, but not here in the open. Follow me. This is far enough. Tell me what you know. Oh, I know loads of things about our elderman. I know his favorite foods. I know when his bedclothes get changed. And I know he hates being bled with leeches. That sort of thing. But where has he gone? Ah, where? I have no bloody idea. Is that what you asked me? Forget it. Oh my god. You old bitch. Are you the head sister here? Aye. And I'm not too comforted by the sight of you wielding weapons like a war chief. We're a hospice, not a barracks. It's bad enough I've got these armored cod pieces watching me work. Now you! No harm will come to you or those you care for. I'm only looking for your elderman. I'd be risking my neck telling you anything. And if my head rolls, these sick and ailing folk will follow me to the grave. Your elderman would agree. So the sooner I find him, the more quickly these prowling guards will leave your hospice. That's a pleasant thought. Our lord was in a bad way here, and getting worse, in spite of our efforts. Then, quite against my instruction, some guards moved him out. I overheard them talking about a bathhouse. There's no working bathhouse in Lincoln. So, I gather they meant the old ruins just south of here, by the eastern walls. Ruins just south of here. I'll look there. Thank you. I pray you find him. He's in desperate need of care. Are these the rooms that I came out of that I got stuck in with the kid? <laughs> yep, it's the same ones. It weren't wise to let those mercy and nobles use our tunnels, if you ask me. What choice do we have? At least this way the lovers be. They killed one of their own. What's to stop them from stealing our skulls as well? Because they fear us, see? No one takes us for fools. You got it. Remember. The great for you. Oh. Quick enough. When I 
gonna say quick enough, I mean if you spam the goddamn trigger here. <laughs> These tunnels run deep. Was the ultimate fleeing to a hideaway beneath Lincoln? That's where you kill essentially you want in here. Some ungodly deal. All this traffic has made smuggling a difficult job. Fighting here. About what? A violent struggle between nobles and bandits. Bandits didn't fare so well. Looks like the ultimate passed this way. Saxon nobleman paid some bandits for permission to sneak through these tunnels on their way to Falling Rock Castle. Mercian nobles made a deal with some bandits. 
paid them hush money to let them sneak through these caves. When the time came, the bandits ambushed the nobles. But it didn't end well for the bandits. In the struggle, the Elderman's cloak was torn off. But he got away and headed east for Bolingbroke Castle. And that's my best lead. Name again, Hati. I cannot remember. I'm actually gonna switch out my mount eventually, like probably after this uh quest one. Stun is also high, speed is a little bit lower, but not by not that much. Throw a smoke bomb after a close shot range. Stealth headshot automatically spawns a trap out here. What the This is the hunter bow, light bow, light bow. This one's obviously better. Uh, can I dismantle weapons? No, I cannot. I don't know. Um, let's upgrade something. This one's three away, three away, three away. Multiple away, multiple. Got four skill points. I'm not going any after anything specific, I believe. I think I just start in the middle and start doing random stuff. Or I just start like where's the like, grid right here? This, cause this one's complete. Oh, this is the middle technically. This one, this one, this one's complete. Anything else that only requires two, by any chance? Uh, this one requires one, this one requires three. I think it's something that only requires two around here. This one. On the right track. That keep is well protected. I'm on the right track, baby. Nice. Are you serious? Oh, yeah, 
an entrance. down there so confused. I'm gonna draw the tall. Yeah, I'm not gonna go down there first. Oh, a good idea. Ooh, we have... We've got some stuff that I want. I'm always looking for more material. These guys don't seem to care about the drawbridge anymore. It's fallen, it's fallen. What can you do? All abilities? No, maybe the ones only with circles are? That's a force, no. I only have two left for each one. Maybe those are DLC ones. But I just pick up. Investigate Algofrith, the farm northwest of Lincoln and Lincolnshire. Let's go to the Nicar. All 
is prepared. Shall we begin the washing? Hey, who comes? Welcome, stranger. Are you here to pay tribute to our Lord Elderman? Oh god, he's dead, isn't he? Shit. This biscuit has been dry for some time, sister. How long has the Elderman been dead? Dead is such a drastic word. I like to think of my Lord as... transformed. That's not untrue. Have you need of anything? Humboldt deserves to know the truth about his father's fate. He is owed an inheritance and deserves a chance to become Elderman himself. All in good time, I imagine. No, now. When the guards put him in my care, I was told to keep all this a secret. Until the appointed time. When I asked who gave these orders, they struck me. I wish I could say more. I've seen all I need to, but Hunbold will need proof. Of course. You're welcome to search through his effects, though I'm not sure what trinket would best serve your purpose. That brush is flown. I'll find something. Alright, so she doesn't seem bad. Dried herbs and berries, crushed into powder. The time between my lord's departure and his burial is longer than usual. My lord must keep up appearances for his upcoming rites. A box of musty clothing and a brooch with a crest. The house of the ferocious swan. This will do. I'll return this brooch to Humboldt and Lincoln. I hope the poor boy can withstand such ill news. I don't know what this is, and I'd rather not ask. Yes, I thought the same. Troubling. Droppings everywhere. Even in death, my lord is a friend to all of God's creatures. Take care. And you. I shall take you to your family crypt at Nettleham within Lincoln. There, you may lay beside your forebears. Right. I'll come back to this place later on. Evil. What news? 
Your father's dead. Wait, what? The sigil of Humbiot's house. I found it near his body. No. No, this cannot be. He was strong. A pillar of Lincolnshire. He cannot be gone. He... He... <laughs> oh, you poor boy. I'm so, so sorry. I am a man, Archer. Do you hear me? I am a man and I am my father's son. Do not forget it! Keep steady, Hunwald. You're now the head of your house. Another swan takes flight. Only I remain. Last in a line of... ...dwindling nobles. I'm sorry, Hunwald. I had already asked a priest to administer last rites when your father disappeared. What? I didn't tell you sooner because I... I thought by some miracle he had survived. You lied to me! You silly, sobbing mooncalf. Will you never grow up? Lord have mercy on that woman. She should have said something. It was her duty to say something. You need a new elderman here. And it falls to King Cheowulf to make that choice. For once we find agreement, Eivor. The nobles here will convene a shy mood to select a new candidate. The winner will stand before the king for approval. Explain how this works, your Shire Moot. A moot is a meeting of lords. We convene from time to time to steer the course of our Shire. It was always my intention to convene a moot, but between our troubles in Lincoln and the bandits' raids, we slipped into a pattern of convenience. Someone in the Shire wants Hunbold dead. If I have to assemble an army to make sure this meeting is not an ambush, I will. The Shire Mood is a lawful, godly assembly. Unwild will be safe, as will you be. Apart from Hunwald, who else will stand for the ultimate seat? If I may be so bold, I should like to put my name forward. Under my care, this Shire has found some peace this past month. I will offer my name as well. My family has ancient ties to this land, and I am proud to say I have forged quite a friendship with the Danes to the north. Good. My priests will spread word of the moot across the Shire, and will convene in a few days' time. Uh, do visit my estate, Eivor. I have something for you. Something I think you'll enjoy. I'll find the time. Eivor, a word if you don't mind. Is the word Christ or pagan? Oh, I deeply regret my churlish ways when we first met. I did not treat you as my god commands, with kindness and love. Love is a difficult feeling to command. Yes, quite. In any case, thank you for putting this mystery to rest. I do hope we'll see you at the moot. The moot. Unbeoth's death, an open secret. Unwald's enemies may oh, strike again. Welcome here. I, don't I should find him before they do. God, I got tired of him. to console him. I should follow her. We have multiple quests. We gotta figure out the one I'm doing. Speak to Acha, speak to Alfgar. Which one's closer? <laughs> you know me. Whichever one's closer, that's the one I do. Where's Alfgar? Dude, Alfgar's all the way out here. Also, where is this guy? He's somewhere in um, Warden of Well, uh, Town of Lincolnshire. Investigate Alphagarstum Farm northwest of the town of Lincolnshire. Wait, isn't that here? Alphagarstum? Yeah. Oh, that's. That's sussy right there, bro. It's a little sus. Oh, I have another sink point out here. Let's talk to you. 
I have something pointing this way. Yeah, we don't to sneak around, I guess. You just run past these guards. I don't blend in with the monks. Let's actually take one for a while. The hood seems to mess up the cutscene a little bit. Archer, where is Humboldt? I tried to console him, but he pushed me away. I love the boy, I do. But I fear what would happen if he took his father's title. He's fragile and scattered. I saw him ride north, following the paved Roman road. To the old tall tree where he often passed time with his father, I imagine. What devil put you up to all this deception? I wasn't put up, Eivor. I felt compelled to carry on for the good of the Shire. Until I knew the truth. A pretty answer for an ugly lie. I don't think it's her either. It'd be too obvious. I feel like she's... What a pleasant surprise. Would you drink with me? Humboldt. Come, sit, sit. Stay with me a while and contemplate. 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 Contemplate the view. Let's have a drink. Let's have a drink. To the memory of your father. Here we go, oh, us sailing among the leaves so green. Do not gorge on grief, nor give in to sadness, but let your aching love light the meat of your eyes and lead you to triumph. That is quite lovely. My father would have liked you. He liked all those who could swing a sword and speak a verse with ease. He had a large heart and a love for his people. I think I would have liked him too. <laughs> he and I used to wander up this way all the time. He would take me hunting, and I would catch the m most wretched little things if I caught anything at all. I was a rubbish hunter. <laughs> but he always said he was proud. Each and every time. A toast. To your father, Lord Hunbeorth of Lincolnshire. He may have dwindled from this world in death, but in life he was as stalwart as this tree. A wise old oak. Yes. Skull. Skull. <laughs> and then, and then my father says, it's the right goat, but it's the wrong end. <laughs> oh, my Swanborough loves that one. She has a great sense of humor, my lady love. Father would have liked her. Right, your Dane lady love. She sounds lovely. Too lovely to be real. You know what? We should visit her. We should go to Brimsky, uh, gr Grimsby. Yes, yes, there's no time to lose. After you. Nothing like drinking and riding to jostle your troubles away. And the contents of your gut. Oh, no wonder him. 
and enjoy the splendor of my shine. You Saxons and your tiny splendor. You've never seen mountains, have you? Or deep fjords, like a giant's axe wound. Or towering falls that steam in the dead of winter. Snow sparkling like a blanket of jewels. That is splendor. Well, if your homeland is so splendor full, why come to England at all? Ah, uh, you can't grow crops on a blanket of jewels. <laughs> Very true. I'll admit, your countryside does take the breath away. Quite so, quite so. I love this land. And should I follow my father's footsteps, I shall do my solemn duty to protect her. I know many think me foolish, inexperienced, but I would ask that they judge me by my future hopes, not my past reputation. If I am given... Will we ever get up here? ...and show myself to be a poor leader, shame me, punish me, of course, but give me that chance. My God, I just want to have that chance. What was that? Birds, Eivor. Has no one told them today is a day of grief? Yes. Glad. Stop here. Something isn't right. I'll find the trouble before it finds us. That's twice they've tried to kill you, Hunwald. And twice failed! We had luck. But if you're not more careful, they will succeed. Someone in Mercia wants you dead. And they'll kill anyone in the way to see it done. Yes, including my dear Swanborough, my lady love. Come, let us hurry away! I'm serious, Hunwald. Are you hearing me? Plain and clear. Follow me! Unwald, are you sure this place is safe? The safest spot in the Shire, yes. Here I am with a chance to be Elderman, but I have yet to prove myself worthy. To you, to the Shire, to her. 
I can do nothing without my darling lady. You've made me realize how much I've neglected her. You insane stupor of mine. This I must see for myself. Yeah! sure you'd be dead why didn't you send word it has been far too long my little jewel i'm so very sorry for that i am fine my love i wilt it without you but still i grow and who is this ah yes i am proud to present eivor of the raven clan hello eivor a pleasure to meet you And you, Swanborough. I wasn't sure what to make of Hunwald's stories, yet here you are. Surprised to find the Dane by his side? Not quite. I'm surprised to find the Saxon at yours. Hunwald seems to endear himself to all sorts. Eivor agreed to help me find my father. But I'm afraid it hasn't gone as well as I'd hoped. What's happened? My father is dead. Died of a cruel disease, apparently. ...then shunted off to a cellar for burial. Oh, my love, I'm sorry. And someone in your shire wants to make sure Hunwald follows his father to the grave. Let them try. I'll cut their throats. A shire mood will soon be held. Hunwald should stay here, out of sight, until he can attend. What if I left it all behind, my love? Forget my father's seat. What if I stayed here with you? Just the two of us. Hunwald, no. This Shire must be led with courage and heart. Follow in your father's footsteps and lead the Shire as he did. Whatever strength you lack, you have in Swanborough. Heed her advice. Yes. If anyone can lift my spirits in time for the Shire moot, it's you, my dear. Come inside and rest your bumbling bones, love. Be well, Eivor, and thank you. Keep watch over that one. Men have come for him more than once. My blade will keep him safe. I don't doubt it. Alright, so for a fresh move.